Hey, before y'all even um continue to watch this video, I just want to give a warning. The following content may contain elements that are not suitable for some audience. That means if you're squeamish, you don't like skin, your kids is watching, get your ass on, okay? Accordingly, viewer discretion is advised, okay? So like I said, if you don't like skin, you don't like the white meat, don't watch. I'm going to say it again, but don't watch. Is that understood? I warrant you. What's up, guys? It's your girl, Chucky. And I'm back with another. Hi, I'm Chucky. And I'm your friend to the end. Heidi Ho. <laughs> <laughs> Did you miss me? So y'all listen, I thought I'd come and tell y'all this story um, of me in the hospital because uh, why the fuck not? Um, so um, long story short, I spilled a pot of boiling hot water on myself and I am, um, I had, um, I had babe drive me to St. Francis because that's like one of our carriers for our insurance or whatever it's called or recipients for our insurance. Um, so I had her drive me there and they, you know, gave me pain meds that like help, you know, a little bit, but it's not, it's not doing what it needs to do. Um, but, um, they gave me pain meds and then, um, that was about it, but they sent me, they sent me over here to Hillcrest because Hillcrest has the best burn unit. Um, so, um, uh, I just got to Hillcrest. Um, I was in the middle of trying to make up look when I spilled the pot of boiling hot water on me. Um, so I, that's why I look like this. Um, but I'm going to show you guys my burns right quick. So, let's see. So, um, they just gave me more pain meds. And they had to give me a technic shot since my wounds are open. And then on top of that, they're gonna have to um, pain medicine. So if she gets a little loopy, you know why? Okay. Scrub. Thank you, sir. To get um, all this dead skin and stuff, which I'm not looking forward to. Hey. Um, so. <sighs> Thank you, sir. You're welcome. We pretty much just went in here to give me some medicine and decided if I was staying up. So, I'll keep you guys updated. I'll show you my wounds later. I'm so doped up on pain meds that's not working and I'm tired. My ears go so slow. I was going to say something to y'all. Mm. I'll just see y'all later. I'm tired. Oh, it's currently like 2 something in the morning, I think. It's about to be 3 o'clock. It's 2.55. So, I'll see you in a little bit. So, um, one of the doctors just came in 
And she said that I needed to be treated. <coughs> I don't remember. Good morning guys, it is <coughs> Saturday. Um, most of you already know what's going on. I gave you a little brief um, yesterday, um, but I didn't give you uh, a full, you know, rundown on everything that's going on. So when I get a chance to really sit, I'll talk to you guys, but, um, I'm having to walk and get some, um, uh, get my blood circulating because my left leg is, um, numb. I can barely feel it, but it's, it's like some discomfort and pain all at once, if that even makes sense. So, um, I've had breakfast. I couldn't eat it. I'm having trouble still eating. Um, my team has been awesome. Johnny, Nancy, Savannah, Randy. Um, I just met Amy this morning, so I'll have her today. I got to go for the tank to um, to get re-wrapped, and I'll show you like my wraps before I head back to the tank. But I wanted to keep you guys updated and let you know what was going on and just document my process because since I've been here, they have been nothing but helpful and I'm very appreciative of the whole team here at Hillcrest. Um, they've just been phenomenal, um, making sure that I was comfortable, making sure that babe was comfortable. Um, I have no complaints. Um, haven't really had to complain about pain at all. They gave me a Percocet last night and bitch, I was out, okay? They put me on my ass and I slept so good. And then that lady came in at two o'clock this morning to draw some blood. Like, ma'am, it's two o'clock in the morning. what's up guys so it is monday july or monday june 6th it is currently about to be one o'clock um and i could possibly be going home today they said that milestones are eating um um pooping and um going into the tank with no pain meds and i did no pain meds and my healing uh process looks great so she said that she's gonna talk to the doctor and see if i could possibly go home today and i'm so ready because i'm so sleep deprived i don't know what to do with myself um they come in every freaking two hours <laughs> that lady gonna come in and say um oh my god you girls can sleep lady 
we could sleep because we're not getting any sleep. Y'all keep coming in here waking us up. So my sleep is not getting all the way out. Everybody knows I get cranky when I get no sleep. And right now, I'm kind of cranky and irritated with all the ladies on this floor, even though they've been so great and nice to me. Um, But I'm, I'm ready to go home. Like, now. Ready to go home. Hey guys, I just wanted to come and tell you guys whew, that I am officially home now. So um, I need food, I don't need snacks, and I need weed. A lot of it, please. Y'all, babe says she don't want to call me Lester. Tell me I don't look like Lester from Grand Theft Auto with this cane. Y'all, I'm so glad to be home. I ain't sat down. I'm about to sit down. I don't want to hurt y'all mouth. Don't yell at me, okay? I'm about to sit down. Y'all see y'all see my little pads and stuff? Y'all see my snacks? Y'all want to know what's messed up? One of the nights I was in the hospital, babe ended up getting trapped in an elevator for over an hour. And I ended up sleeping through the whole thing because I was pretty much high on Percocets. Hey, gents. Um, today is Wednesday. Um, Kai, I need your help. Sorry, guys. Today is Wednesday. It is the 9th um, of June. Um, it is currently almost uh, 12 o'clock, almost 1, I believe. Can you turn the light switch on, please, and unplug the light, please? My, my charger is not on. Uh, don't pull it like that. Thank you. Why would you do that and people's hands touch that? You don't know who was scratching their booty and now you got booty juice all on your face. Wasn't me, but I'm just saying. You never know. One of us might have been scratching dead in our booty cheeks and now you got booty juice on your face. I'm just saying. You never know. Um, what are you doing? I'm talking to myself. Um, update I really don't have an update. Shower time was a lot easier this time. Um, because when I went to the tank in the hospital, just water hitting my wounds, um, was pretty bad. So, um, I will uh, try to get some um, updated footage of my healing process today. <clears throat> and then um, we will just go from there. Um, yeah, so my, my goal is to try to um, just do one video of the whole process so that I can... Um, my goal is to have one video of the whole process. I have a doctor's appointment next week. So I am off all this week sitting in this spot. I literally sit here all day and then I go get in my bed. Um, well, I go take my shower and then I get into bed. Um, I think that's what I'm going to start doing um, or whatever. So I just wanted to come in, do a little mental check. Um, yesterday, yesterday was really, really rough for me. Um, today is a little bit better. Um, a little discomfort, not so much. I feel like my recovery process is going to be um, about two weeks. Um, just because my doctor's appointment is on Wednesday. So we will see. Um, I know I said I was going to show you guys bath time yesterday, but I cannot, um, for one, I don't need y'all seeing all my goodies. Um, and then for two, it's just too, too much, um, to, to show you guys like wound care and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, 
I will, I guess, see you guys later today. Um, I've already taken my meds. Oh, that was one thing. So, um, uh, you guys know I have the eating disorder. So, I am having to drink these. Which, the chocolate ones are nasty. But, I do have to drink these when I'm not eating. And then, they have me taking... Um, I don't know if you can see, I got some vitamin C here, multi-gummy stool softeners and then Percocets. And then um, also Flexeril um, is what I'm taking every four to six hours um, to help with the pain. So, yeah. So, I will see you guys later i'm about to take a nap because it's kicking in mm. look at that color coming in mm -hmm. looking real nice Ooh. sorry Slipped on my hand. Feel like it's it feel like it's pulling off pretty good. Like you know, normally it'd be sticking. Mm-hmm. You're doing good. Yeah, that's feeling up real nice. Oh, I know. I'm glad she wasn't live. Right. Live for the five. I think we in the clear, right? After that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Four and a half. Straight. Ah. Hold it. what's up guys so it is friday and um i'm just coming to give an update y'all i'm in the itching stage do you hear me so um i'm gonna show you like what my legs look like right now and i've just been getting off all the dead skin but um i do want to come and give y'all update and show y'all what my legs look like so So I'm looking real dry. Look at that. And crusty right now. Third degree. Not touching. Cause that mug hurt. But yeah. I'm looking real dry and crusty right now. And I'm just so happy to like just be out of my bandages for a little bit before I gotta get back in. Let's see, it's crusty. 